Well, time now to wake up smarter and connect the dots when we go beyond the headlines. We told you about businesses struggling to find workers. It's a problem in a wide variety of fields. And it's not just dollars and cents causing it. Stephanie Whitfield connecting the dots on why so many people aren't ready to go back to work. As the country slowly starts to reopen, the help wanted signs are going up. But business owners say finding workers is tough right now. Let's connect the dots. The coronavirus pandemic hit the U.S. economy hard. It's estimated that over 20 million jobs were lost. Now some businesses are ready to reopen and they need workers to do that. But there's a problem. Workers aren't applying. So how bad is it? At least one McDonald's franchise in Florida is offering people $50 just to apply. The issue is hitting small businesses especially hard. The National Federation of Independent Business found in March that 42% of its members had job openings they couldn't fill. Restaurants of all sizes are feeling the heat. They were some of the first businesses to lose workers when the pandemic hit. And they're now having a tough time finding workers again. So what's the problem? Workers report concerns about being exposed to the virus, also finding childcare. While some business owners are blaming expanded unemployment, Right now, for some low-paying jobs, especially part-time ones, it's tough to compete with better benefits. Though some states like Texas have reinstated the requirement that people collecting unemployment prove they're applying for jobs. Connecting the dots, I'm Stephanie Whitfield, 